tonight that we are tracking a SWAT situation just wrapping up in Buffalo tonight with a SWAT team rushing in to capture a suspect who barricaded himself inside. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Jason Grinauer is live on Clinton Street. Jason. Well, Kendra, this is what we know that standoff that started here on the 1600 block of Clinton Street in Buffalo started around 430. That is now over. A suspect in a black ski mask could be seen from the upstairs window of the home here on the left hand side, just behind that street light. He reportedly threw knives and other objects at police. Witnesses on scene say the man even started his curtains and part of his roof on fire. SWAT stormed the home around 5 30 tonight. The man climbed out onto the roof that goes over. Over his porch. There was a loud bang. He climbed back in and then it was over. SWAT has since left the scene. Police detectives are now here. We're still waiting to hear from Buffalo police on some type of motive or what really led up to all of this. Now, this section of Clinton Street, which runs under the 190 here in Buffalo, still remains closed as first responders are still here on the scene trying to look through all the clues and find out exactly what happened. As far as we can tell, however, that suspect is no longer here on the scene. No word on his condition tonight. Stay with 7 Eyewitness News and WKBW.com on Facebook and on Twitter for all the latest developments. For now, we're live here on Clinton Street in Buffalo. Jason Grenauer, 7 Eyewitness News.